President Kenyatta has appointed Chief Justice Martha Karambu Kome after the National Assembly approved a nomination. Following a report by the Justice and Legal Affairs Committee that recommended her approval, MPs were divided on the future of judiciary's independence, with some members accusing it of propagating judicial capture of the state after five judge bench nullified the BBI constitutional amendment process backed by President Kenyatta and ODM leader Raila Odinga. That uh, Lady Justice Mother Komi would take it as part of continuing the reform that was started by Justice Mutunga, the reforms by Justice Maraga, are now consolidated for the common good, so that it's not people just trying to get even, uh, revisiting one another, but now looking at the Kenyan people and where the judiciary should be, not just for Kenya, but for the region. I want to speak to Lady Justice Mother Kome and ask her to jealously guard the independence of the judiciary. She must protect the judicial officers, Honorable Speaker, from the intimidation we have seen from the likes of Raphael Tuju of the Jubilee Party, threatening judicial officers that they may uh, lose their security, Honorable Speaker, if they take certain decisions. Honorable Speaker, I pray that CJ nominee Martha Kome will not preside over another night sitting out of intimidation over the BBI matter or any other matters in the Republic of Kenya, Honorable Speaker. Justice Kome has assured the committee that uh, she will be judging judges, judging judges. I want to array fears by Ichungwa. I don't need a hand to answer anything because all the matters that he raised are extraneous. Tuju is not a member of the committee. We are not considering Tuju or anybody else. That I support the nomination of Honorable Lady Justice Martha Kome and Mr. Speaker, especially given that she's the first woman to be given this position, it is actually a tragedy that in this age and time, we are still talking of first woman this and first woman that. That is something that we should have left almost 30 years ago. And I'm hoping, Mr. Speaker, that we will not then hound the deputy out of the office because she's a woman. Uh, because we know, if you look at this country, there are very many men holding men multiple positions. Nobody has hounded them out because they are men. Let us have a Lady Justice, Chief Justice, and a Deputy Lady Justice, who is another woman. Let us not hound the other woman out of office. This House approves the appointment of Honorable Lady Justice Mother Karambu Koome as Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya. Will as many as of that opinion say aye? Aye. And as of a contrary opinion say nay, the ayes have it.